This is Furry Marie 7 and I am having a slight problem. Uh, I just recently, just uh, about a week and a half, maybe a couple weeks ago, uh, about three weeks ago, noticed that the the colors on my video are too bright. Now I don't know if this what what the technical term for this is. I don't know whether it's called brightness or saturation or hue or intensity or whatever else. I don't <laughs> I, I don't know the technical names for these. But the colors on my videos are too bright. But that's only some videos. The colors on the rest of the videos are okay. I'll show you what I mean. So this right here, you are looking at a, a YouTube uh, video. This is a video that I uploaded onto YouTube. And this is the way the colors are supposed to look. Um... Uh, uh, this, uh, they're, they're, they're not too bright. This is the way it looked when I recorded them from my game console. But if I were to open this same video in we Windows Media Player, it ends up looking like this. As you can see, you can see the, uh, <clears throat> you can see that there's noticeable difference in between. Uh, the colors on this one are too bright. Uh, you can especially see, you can especially notice this with the upper, on the upper right hand corner. If you look at the two, uh, mini maps in the upper right hand corner they are <clears throat> noticeably different uh, the one on the left uh, is way has way too much color than the one on the right now uh, <clears throat> uh, it would be if, if it, now if this problem was only with Windows Media Player that would be a different story but if you look on the YouTube video if I were to change this from normal into full screen Bam! Then it changes into the brightly colored version that we saw in Windows Media Player. And when I change back to normal screen, then the colors go back to normal, the way they're supposed to be. Now, I don't know what the problem with this is. I, tr I thought this was um, maybe a problem with Flash Player, that it wasn't up to date. I updated my Adobe, Adobe Flash Player, got it up to date, and this problem is still happening. I downloaded Java. I don't know what Java has anything to do with this, but I tried that anyway. I realized I did not have the current version of Java, so I downloaded the current version of Java, and the same thing happened. Uh, I tried <clears throat> you know, pretty much everything. I tried fiddling with the settings in Windows Media Player. I tried going to the video settings, but none of these settings actually affect the video at all. And no matter what I set these settings to... Um, uh, nothing actually really works. Nothing really affects the video, no matter what I set the settings to. Nothing, n nothing, nothing happens, no, no, nothing changes with the video when I change the settings. And so, um, that's weird. But, uh, but, uh, also the other thing that's weird is... Uh, with a program that I use to edit my videos. I don't use, like, the fancy programs like Sony Vegas or anything like that. I just use a, a basic program called Roxio Video Wave. This is the program that I use to edit my videos. And this looks um, eerily similar to <laughs> the YouTube version. Uh, this is the way the colors are supposed to be um, at normal level. They're not, they're not too bright and... Uh, there's a lot, I, I, it seems that there's a lot of a yellow, or maybe a lack of blue. I don't know what the technical term is, but it seems that, um, I, I don't know, it, it just seems, compared to, this is the Windows Media Player right here, it just seems that, uh, you know, I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know, it, it's too much yellow, uh, not of blue, or brightness, or whatever, I don't know what the, the technical term for this is called, but... Windows Media Player is displaying things too brightly. Now I didn't. Now I didn't actually first notice the Windows Media Player right away. I actually first noticed this when I was starting to record my videos. I use the program that I use to uh, record my gameplay is called AverMedia Rec Central. I'll bring it up right here. And if I and I when I started recording, I noticed that the colors on here were too bright. Uh, <sighs> The uh, the colors on the Aver Media were too bright, and uh, I, I I noticed that I thought there was a problem with my game capture at first. Um, tr I was I tried to uh, fid fiddle with the settings on my game check capture that didn't work, um, and then I thought and then I for and then I thought it was my computer that was making those settings. Maybe something wrong with my graphics card. So what I did was I went to my 
uh, the settings on my graphics card and um, I went to graphics properties and this <clears throat> get rid of that the graphics properties uh, didn't really help I tried fiddling with the graphics properties I'll show you what it is I tried I tried a whole bunch of different things I first went to color enhancement but the color enhancement doesn't really work the color enhancement is not going to get <clears throat> the desired outcome because this I tried saturation but all these enhancements control the entire screen it doesn't just control these one video these this one video that I'm trying to control the color on the rest the coloration on the rest of my monitor is just fine and like I said before when it comes to videos on YouTube it's just fine it's only certain videos like these um, Windows Media Player and YouTube full screen. Those, um, and also the, the the video on my Aver Media uh, Player. But I think my Aver Media Player runs off of settings from other programs on my computer. But um, I don't know what's going on here. I tried a whole bunch of different stuff. This stuff doesn't help. This on this the Intel graphics control panel doesn't help. I tried fiddling with these settings and none of them. None of them help because it controls the entire screen. It's not just um, the one video. How do I get it back to where it was? Okay, it's not this. That's not just this one video. Uh, uh, you know, it is just this one. It's not the entire screen. It's just. It's just this. I don't even know if it's a problem. It's not. I, I don't know. If, I don't think it's a problem with the video. Because what happens is when I record my video, um, it. It's uh, when I record my video, it's really bright. I'll show you again. When I record my video, it's this. And by the way, my TV does not look like this. By the way, my TV shows the nor my TV is the uh, and my video game dis is displaying the correct color. Um, but on the on the when I record my videos, it looks like this. And then, uh, at, once I edit my videos and place my v video in the video editor, it looks like that. And then after I'm done editing and rendering, the video looks like this. And then after I upload it to YouTube, it looks like this. And then after I press full screen, it looks like that. So it just changes from one to another. And I, I really don't know. I, I've, I've tried everything I know how. I don't know uh, what to do. And... Uh, for those of you, my fans out there, who's wondering <laughs> what I'm doing, I've actually, uh, I've actually uploaded this video because I'm sending out this request. I'm, I'm posting on multiple different forums across the internet trying to get an answer, and I'm going to redirect those people to this video so that they can see with their own eyes how this problem is happening, and they can see all the solutions that I've tried. And hopefully, if anybody can give me a solution to help me with this, uh. Please feel free to reply, leave a comment. I'll give you a shout out on your YouTube channel. I don't know. I'll, I'll think of, <laughs> I'll think of some sort of some sort of reward. Maybe I'll give you Microsoft points, like I did with my last one. Um, of course, they're not doing Microsoft points anymore. They're doing just regular regular cash. But uh, I'll, I'll do something because this. This is getting annoying. Um, it's not as annoying as it could be because I know that when I upload the videos that other people are not seeing the distorted picture. Other people are seeing, when, when everyone else watches my YouTube video, they're seeing what they're supposed to be seeing, which is, which is this. Uh, this is what they're supposed to be seeing. But uh, when I watch the videos, the only thing I can see is this right here. So, I don't know. If anyone can help... Please, please give me a suggestion. Thank, thank you very much.